Okay. Hello. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And most welcome to my channel, Mushaf Maths Tutorial. Dear students, how are you all? Hopefully you are fine. Dear students, how are you today? Hopefully you are fine. Today we are going to discuss area related theorems and constructions that is chapter five. This chapter is very, very important for SSC exam. Uh, so this theorem actually fully based on uh, Pythagoras theorem. I think you have learned this one from grade eight, nine and grade 10 what first time also so this one is very very important theorem and with the help of this theor theorem uh, you will be able to solve uh, exercise 15 uh, theorem 13 to 17 so hopefully i think you can enjoy this lesson so let's get started Okay, students, you can partici uh, participate. Masha Zaman, if you are Hello. Is it clear? Students? Hello. Okay. Sound is okay or not? Sound is okay or not? Clear? Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, thank you. Okay, Taspir Joan, Wahi, Maisha Zaman, Habiba, Fabiha Ibna. Students, you can participate. Surely you will learn a lot. It will be the best use of your time. Okay, don't you waste your time? You can join. So, let's see. This one is exercise 15. Uh, this exercise, nine number. 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17. Uh, theorems are very, very important. You can mark this one. So here, 13 number, this one came, Dhaka word 17, means Qatar. Uh, so let's see the question. Angle A equal one right angle of the triangle ABC. Angle A means what 90 degree of triangle ABC. D is a point on AC. Prove that BC square plus AD square equal BD square plus AC square. So if you want to solve this one, you need two what? The two triangles. With the help of two triangles, easily you will be able to solve. Uh, this theorem. Okay, am I clear to you? First of all, before solving this one, first of all, uh, here few MCQs are there. One, two, three, and four. First of all, try to four MCQ. After that, I will solve this one. Okay, let's see the MCQ. This one, this one number and two numbers, fully based on this diagram let's see the diagram so let's see the diagram see this one is a one kind of what equilateral triangle equilateral triangle means whose three sides are equal see a b 
equal AC equal BC whose length is what? 2 cm. If this was 2 cm, ultimately BC also 2 cm and AC also 2 cm. So, with the help of this diagram, first of all, you have to find the length of BD. Number 2, what is the height of the triangle? Height of the triangle means you need to find the length of AD. Okay. Students, for doing this one, uh, I will give you two minutes. Within two minutes, you can try to solve. Then I will explain. Okay, try to solve. Is it clear? What is clear? Let's focus on both. both okay. Maisha Jaman uh, got also card answer. Yes. 1A, absolutely right. You got card answer. Thank you very much, Maisha. What about others? Wahir also got card answer. Thank you very much. Black and white performance is going on for Maisha and Wahir. What about others? Taspia. Tell me the answer. Two number answer. Fabihai Ibnat also joined. Fabihai Ibnat Chur 1A and 2. two. Thank you very much. Fabiha got card answer. Thanks a lot. Okay, there are three four questions is there. One, two, three, four. Jubaida, uh, Jubaida got B. B means who, who is one B? Is there? Don't mention the word question one, two, three like that. You can mention the question because B is whose B is there? One also B is there. Two B also there. There no question B also there. Phone number, but there is no what? There is no option. Okay, try to participate, students. Taspi also got card answer. Uh, Maisha Jamal, thank you very much. Fabia Hitna got card answer. Wahir also got card answer. Thanks a lot, Wahir. See, this one actually very, very easy. Too much easy this question. What is the value of BD? See, BD means, BD means what? Half of BC. See, BD equal half of BC because if AD is perpendicular to BD, that time D is the midpoint of BC. Uh, so we can say BD equal CD equal half of BC. So we can write this one BD equal what? Half of BC. The value of BC means 2. So 2 by 2, it will be 1. Answer 1 centimeter. So I think you got the card answer. One number is over one number answer is over now let's move to two number let's focus on two number clear one number is okay other for us students okay thank you very much now let's move to two number what is the height of the triangle means ad see ad means if you apply pythagoras theorem in triangle abd see don't think about this one only you have to think in triangle what? ABD. ABD means what? AD square plus BD square. AD square plus BD square equal to what? AB square. Or uh, we have to find the length of AD. AD square means AB square minus BD square. Or AD means root AB square minus BD square. What is the value of AB? AB means 2. So AB square means 2 square. 2 square means 4. And BD. BD means, uh, BD means what? Oh, we got 1 from question number 1. We got BD means 1. So BD, 1 square means 1. 4 minus 1, root 3. Okay. So root 3 is the third answer. Means B number. Okay. Am I clear to you? Students, you got the card answer.
Okay, what about the three number answer? Try to solve three number. This exercise fully based on Pythagoras. Pythagoras was a Greek philosopher, mathematician, and religion. Okay. So now tell me the three number answer. Okay, I'm uh, okay, I'm reading three number question in the right angle triangle. A, B, C, angle C equal one right angle, means right angle, one right angle, angle B equal two times of angle A, clear, and B C equal four centimeter, what is the value of A, B? It's very easy, if you think it what nicely, then it's very easy. So option is two centimeter, four centimeter, six centimeter. It's uh, without solving, uh, don't tell the answer. Okay, first of all, you can try to solve, then you can tell the answer because this option is there. Without solving, you can say sir, B number, C number, like this. Don't tell like this. Okay, try to solve. Actually, this one very very important question. This one, 2019 year question. This one came, uh, zero, 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 19, very, very important. And this one came, select board 19. Third number, old question of what? Zero on board, and this one, select board. Have you got the answer? What is the answer? Anything wrong or not? Okay, it will take one minute. If I am giving for this one, one minute. Within one minute, you can try to solve. The students try to participate, mashallah. Many students join. Thank you very much. Don't waste your time. Try to utilize your time. Abil bin Amin, okay. What is the card answer, Abir? For Bihar, if not, got what card answer? What? Three. No, Fabiha. A little bit. Mistake is there. Fabiha, three. Yes. Fabiha, if not, got card answer, 3D. Thank you very much, Fabiha. My also got card answer. What about boys? Hmm? Always that is fast or not? Try to solve, okay? Be fast. Yes, Maisha, you got card answer. Eight is the card answer. Don't worry. If you got three number answer, you can try to solve four number. Those who are here try to participate, okay? If you got any confusion, you can ask me, okay? Don't feel shy. Okay, Pitila also got card answer, 3D. Thank you very much, Pitila. Oh, yes, Noramin also got card answer. Thank you.
Uh, okay. Okay, let's see this one. Angle C equal one right angle means 90 degree. And angle B is two times of angle A. Suppose Yeah, this one angle B and this one angle A. Uh, this one 90. If this one 30 degree, suppose this one will be what 60 degree means two times. Okay, so if you consider this one 30 degree, it will be what 60 degree. 60 plus 30, 90, 90 plus 90, 180 degree. There. So and B is equal what? 4 centimeter. This also given. What is the value of A, B? What is the value of what? A, B. We have to find this one. So do you know? Cos means curly brown hair. Curly means cos theta. Brown hair based by hypotenuse. So you can apply cos theta, cos 60 because base and hypo are given. So that's why cos 60 degree equal BC by AB. Cos 60 means what is the value of cos 60? Half. BC means 4. AB means what? We don't know AB. Okay. Means this we have to find the value of AB. So Next line, you will get the card answer. Therefore, A B equal to 4 to the 8. 8 centimeter. This one is the card answer. I mean, 3 D. Clear, my dear students? Okay, Nurul, Nurul Amin, 4.5 root 2. Uh, actually, write down the option, this one. Uh, this one option is... 5, 5 root 3, 5 root 5, uh, 75, 125. Okay, a number 5 root 3, 5 root 5, 25, 75. Unity centimeter is there. So now tell me what is no, 10 centimeters, sorry. 10 centimeters. Now tell me which one is card answer? Four number. Oh, sir, I am just saying. Okay, thank you very much. Write down your name. Okay, Fabiha Ibnath, what a marvelous performance. Okay, five or three, the card answer. Thank you very much. You got card answer five root three. Five root three, my also got card answer. Taspia, mm, got answer. Thank you very much. Because this one is very easy. Two, uh, uh, two number questions also you did like this problem. AD means, just directly you can solve. AD means root, just like this. AD means root by applying Pythagoras theorem, you get AB square minus what? BD square, like this. Then you'll get the answer. AB means what? 10 square and BD means 5 square. Okay? Am I clear to you? Uh, just say by applying Pythagoras theorem. You can apply Pythagoras theorem in triangle A, B, D. In triangle what? A, B, D means A, B square plus, sorry, A, D square plus B, D square equal to what? A, B square. Or A, D square means A, B square minus B, D square. Then by taking a square root on both sides, then a square and root cancel, and this one is remaining. A, B means what? Value is given. 
10 square. BD means half of BC, means 10 by 2 for the square. Clear? Okay. Now let's see the what theorem 13. This one is very, very important. This one came and cut 2017. Clear? Have you done all of you or not? Yes, crystal clear, board also clear. This one clear, whiteboard. Yes. Oh, Habiba told question was C. This one is an equal external triangle. A, B, B, C, A, C, whose three sides are what? 10 centimeter. Equal to triangle means all sides will be equal. So A, B equal 10, B, C equal 10, and A, C equal 10. Then AD. Then what is the value of AD? Means you have to find this one. Means height. What is the height uh, of this triangle? AD you have to find. So uh, by applying Pythagoras theorem, you will get the correct answer. Okay, why it will clear? Thank you very much. Now this one is very very important theorem. Let's focus on what starting number. Clear? Have you done all of you? Let me know, please. Okay, hi, Bert. Okay. Before solving this one, 30 number, first of all, you need to make a plan. What type of figure is it like that? Don't go through directly this uh, what particular incision proof like this. First of all, you need to make a plan. Uh, means uh, how can you draw the figure and like this? So first of all, you can draw the figure and make a rough. See, uh, angle A equal one right angle of the triangle ABC. First of all, you can draw. A right angle triangle suppose this one is a one kind of right angle triangle A of triangle ABC D is a point on AC so you can consider this vertex C and this vertex what D okay uh, this one C C. So D is a point on AC. Here AC lies there and you can put one point D. Okay. D is a point on AC. Clear? Then prove that C. BC square. BC square means in triangle ABC. Okay. In triangle, uh, in triangle ABC, if we apply Pythagoras theorem in triangle ABC, then we you will get BC square equal what? AC square plus AB square. Okay, only one triangle. You need to what? Make another triangle. So how can you draw another triangle C? If you join, okay, B comma D, then after that, you will get another triangle. The other triangle will be in triangle ABD. So, in triangle ABC, you can apply Pythagoras theorem. And similarly, in triangle ABD, you can apply also Pythagoras theorem. After adding these two triangles, value, then you will get the result. Am I clear to you, students? Clear? Okay. Hmm. Okay, now, first of all, there are some uh, three possibilities there particular incision, incision uh, proof, construction, but say construction not needed. Just you can write down two things particular incision and proof. Clear. Okay. Now you can write down. I think proof not needed here. Sorry. Uh, particular incision, this one, everything is given. Just you can add one thing B and D are joined. 
of the right down particular okay in triangle a b c angle a equal 90 degree d is a point on sc clear d is a point on sc this one is mentioned here given information just you can join a new thing d and b are joined D and B are joined. Clear. It is required to prove that. Don't write like this. Prove that. Means teacher uh, will prove. Okay. So don't think like this. Don't write like this. You can write. It is required to. It is required to prove that. It is required to prove that b c square plus a d square equal b d square plus a c square. Clear? Okay. Write down firstly. Yes, sir, done. Wow. Too much fast. My shine probably hate not. Okay, write down particular decision, then I go to proof. Tasbir, Tasin. Finished. Okay, what the video writing finished. Thank you very much. Okay, so let proof. Okay, in, first of all, you can consider in triangle ABC. In triangle ABC, you can write angle A equal 90 degree and BC is hypotenuse. Okay, according to Pythagoras theorem, actually in Bangla, what you can say Pythagoras, when you, you can say English, you can, uh, you can what, express this on Pythagoras. Okay, keep in mind. According to Pythagoras theorem, or by applying, you can, you can write by applying Pythagoras theorem, what are that? In triangle A, B, C, we get B, C square equal to what? A, B square plus A, C square. It's very easy. You can set this one equation number one because the in left side B, C square is there. That's why, uh, first of all, you can write hypotenuse square equal to the, the sum of the squares of the other so the two sides. Okay? That's why I'm writing like this way. Another triangle, similarly, in triangle ABD, how can you write similarly? Similarly, 
clearly in triangle ABG we get B D square. Yeah, here A D is there. So that's why I don't write B D square equal A D square plus A D square. First of all, you can write this one square plus that one square to B D square. Always you need to focus on what? Both left side, which are given and right side. So A D square plus A B square equal B D square or A D square equal B D square minus A B square. This one equation two. After joining equation one and two, you will get the proof. Clear? Any confusion or no not? In this one, this one chapter, uh, chapter 15. Okay, means exercise 15, question number 13. Why so late in this cell? Why are you in this cell? Already four MCQ finished. Yes, chapter 15, Jananda. Thank you very much. Okay, am I clear to you this one? Now joining, adding equation one and two, then we'll get the answer. Just you can join. Finish writing, have you done all of you? Actually, only watch. If you know the Pythagoras theorem, then you can solve. Nothing else is there. Okay, now adding equation one and two. Adding now adding equation one and two, we get. See, this one equation one and this one equation two. Now we can join BC square plus AD square. This one left side and this one and that one right side. Now we can join AB square plus SC square plus BD square plus and minus it goes to minus. It will be minus AB square. So let's see this one and that one same below but opposite side. This one that one goes to cancel. Now remaining values are s square plus b d square. So answer is over b d square plus s square. Therefore, b c square e plus a d square equal b d square plus s square proved. Okay, finally we got the answer. Clear. Yes, Abir, this math is pretty straightforward, sir. I don't see any way of confusion. Thank you very much. If you have good concept regarding Pythagoras theorem, then it's quite easy for you. Okay. After finishing this one, I will discuss another very pretty question like dinner school boot 17. Now you can write down. Maisha Jama, no confession. Thank you very much. Fabi Haibnad also, no confession. Thank you, actually. So, talent students, I got I'm very lucky. Okay, now write down the one question. Uh, write down the other questions. This one came, the uh, Dinaspur board 2017. Wahid done. Okay, thank you. Now write down. I'm telling, then you can write. Okay. A, B, C is an. Students, you can write down. First of all, listen carefully. Pay attention. Sound is clear or not? Okay, clear. A, B, C 
is an equilateral triangle and AD is perpendicular to BC. Clear? Okay. ABC again I'm telling ABC is an equilateral triangle and AD is perpendicular to BC full stop prove that comma 4AD square equal 3AD square clear this one actually very very important first of all you can try to solve this one here, 17 number actually. This one came from 17 number. Keep in mind. This one came from where? 17 number. 17 C. Okay. A, B, C, equilateral triangle, and A, D is perpendicular to B, C, prove that 4, A, D square equal 3, A, B square. This one is the symbol of perpendicular symbol. Okay. Students try to solve the at first try to solve this one. Uh, if you don't solve, then I will explain it. And no, no problem. This one, nothing else, just applying Pythagoras theorem. Okay, no problem. My scissor one tool, you can use the okay. Black marker, I can use no problem. I have many markers. See, only for you. Okay, don't worry. Yes, only 30 number finish and 4 MCQ also, okay? Uh, this one, uh, actually 17 number question, but this one came, uh, they are for 17. As well as try to participate, okay? Okay, in this are Monday and Wednesday. Okay, every Monday and Wednesday, I will take live class. Okay, don't worry. Monday and Wednesday. Okay, keep in mind. Oh, guys, also join. Okay, students, try to join. Maisha Jaman, to, yes, Wednesday at uh, 6.30 and Monday 7.30. Okay. Yes. 
if mechanism is a little bit what ups and down like this. Okay, at first try to solve what this one. Is it easy for you or not? Okay, those who are here, students try to participate. Okay, Kitila, what happened? Why you are crying too much? Don't cry, try to solve. Okay, Kitila, you have to fight through some bad days to earn the best days of your life. Okay, you think this one is hard? No, nothing. This one is quite easy. Just with the help of Pythagoras theorem. You can solve this one, okay? Don't think like that. So don't cry. Yes, don't cry, okay? Take it easy. It's too yummy. Yes, but like now, this are not available, Lippy Roy. <laughs> yes, Abhi, try to focus on what? Problem. Yes, thank you. Maisha. Yes, the same. It's very yummy. Don't eat now. After finishing, then you can eat. Wow. But Mama Sulaiman, Sulaiman, what happened? Try to solve. Don't comment with each other, okay? Try to focus on the last proposed 2017 question. Finished or not? If you finish this one, let me know. Yes, Muhammad Sulaiman, trying. Thank you very much. Yes, a little more steps, but there's not too much step. Fabia Ibnath, sat down. Thank you very much, Fabia. Kayas two one eighty, sat down. Wow, thank you very much. My Shazawan finished, guys. Finish. Okay, students can participate. Those who are here, try to participate. Okay. Okay, I have another class at 8 p.m., grade 11 and 12. Okay, try to solve. Be hurry. Okay, let's see. ABC is an equilateral triangle. First of all, you can draw 
a triangle a a b c is a triangle a b c is a triangle it not only triangle this one is equilateral triangle means both all sides are equal so you can consider like this dot uh, and a d is perpendicular to b c means d is the midpoint of b c that time we can say b d equal c d equal half of b c clear so we have to prove that four a d square equal to uh, three a d square okay write down the particular enunciation particular Okay, so that is over. Let's come to the point. So, in triangle ABC, AB equal BC equal what? AC. Being this one is equilateral triangle, that's why all sides, all sides are equal. And AD is perpendicular to what? BC. It is required to prove that it is required to prove that 4 AD square equal 3 AD square. Clear? Particular enunciation this one is over. Let's move to proof. Okay. In triangle A B C, you can write again A B equal B C equals A C, and B D equal C D equal what? Half of B C. Clear? B D equal C D equal half of B C. Why? Since A D is perpendicular to what? A D is perpendicular to B C. That's why. Clear. In triangle ABC, this one AB equal AC equal BC and AD is perpendicular to BC. That's why we can write this one equal that one equal half of BC. Clear. Okay. Now in triangles ABD, don't think about this one. This one only you can focus on what? Triangle ABD. By applying Pythagoras theorem in triangle ABD, uh, we will write AD square plus BD square equal AB square. Okay, you can write what? In trying by applying by applying Pythagoras theorem in triangle. A, B, D, we get A, D square plus 
bd square equal to what ab square our proof is what ad in left side ad is there so this one you can take left side and other what values goes to right side or ad square equal ab square minus bd square this one you can pass but to what right side it will be minus so ab square bd bd means what half of bc so you can write half of bc whole square clear is it clear for you okay i think so let's move to another line or next line will be a b square equal to a b square minus c what is the right side right side is a b so b c uh, ultimately it will be a b why because a b equal b c equal a c that's why you can write b c instead of a b so a b we can write a b instead of what b c so a b square by four okay and so it's about to finish if, uh, what is the LCM? 4 LCM, you will get 4 AB square minus AB square. It will be 3 AB square uh, by 4. Therefore, 4 AB square equal what? 3 AB square. Okay, proved. Okay. If you got any confusion, please let me know. Or you can ask me. I think this one is very easy. Now we can remove this one. Clear? Which year? This one is Dinas Purbo 2016. DJ. Abir. Abir is there or not? Okay, now now write down. Now write down two homeworks with the help of this one. Now write down two homework. Writing finish. Have you done all of you? Okay, Abhi, thank you very much. When I saw this one, that time what? That time what? I always remind you, Abhi. Because I never for never ever forget you what dance in at picnic. Okay, writing finished or not? Please let me know. Habiba. Have you finished your writing? Okay, Taiwakta finished. Habiba, writing is finished. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Okay, now write down two homework with the help of these two problems or theorems. We'll be able to solve. What? Do homework, I think so. Okay, write down. Homework, write down what? The notebook. Write down in your notebooks, okay? This two homework. Um, PQR PQR is an isosceles isosceles right angle triangle right angle triangle and B is any point on 
PQ show that PQ show that R Q square R Q square plus P D square equal P Q square plus R D square. This one number one. Now let's move to number two. QD is a median median of triangle PQR. If PQ equal QR equal PR, then show that then show that four Q D square then show that four Q D square equal three P Q square. Clear? Okay, write down. Do you feel any disturbance like this? Previous. Okay, same. This one, same as 13, and this one, same as 17, question like that. So, Monday, question like in. Okay, I hope all of you understood this lesson. So thank you very much for your patience. Uh, so, uh, try to follow the rules and regulation provided by Qatar. And stay always stay at home, and don't waste your beloved time, because your upcoming SSC exam is. Okay, I think you will do the homework in time, so you should be disciplined and a study you should study regularly inshallah see you again in the next class if you enjoy this lesson don't forget like comment and subscribe my channel and please let me know about your thoughts allah peace best of luck okay thank you very much